What is up everybody and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon X Wonder Wedlock. In the previous episode, it was a super long live stream and a lot of stuff happened and it was like over a month ago or something crazy like that. So first of all, apologies to everybody out there who's been waiting so patiently for Pokemon X Wonder Wedlock to return. Unfortunately, the PGL just kind of took over the channel and uh, I ran out of time to like be recording stuff because I was working a job and focusing on the PGL and I know it's not really an excuse and I feel really bad um, about it, but it was sort of one of those things like I had all this stuff going on um, real life and, and other things like that and then not doing Pokemon X I sort of lost uh, the steam, like the like let's keep doing it, keep doing it kind of thing, um, and I lost the steam and motivation to keep like doing it because I wasn't doing it. So here's me trying to make an effort to bring the Pokemon X Wonder Wedlock back to you guys. So if you are excited, you want to see the series recontinue, please go ahead shield bash that like button down below. Uh, the future of this series may depend completely upon the support that it receives, um, because at this point. Uh, we may be at this point where like people aren't interested anymore because it took me so long to get to the next episode Which would be completely my fault not you guys at all That's my fault for screwing you guys over and just not getting an episode up or recording an episode um, So a lot of mumbling to go on in the beginning of this episode because there's such a large gap between episodes So really quickly wanted to also state uh, There's some things that have changed. I used to go back in um, through this method um, so you guys know when I catch a Pokemon and I want to trade it, you can't actually rename those Pokemon. Uh, well, for a while I was working around that because I was going into um, this like uh, what's the right word for it? This this mod, not modding, but uh, people can like inject Pokemon into their games. Um, so what I was doing is I was grabbing the file of the Pokemon that already exists, like the same Pokemon, and I was just changing its name and re-importing it into the game so it would have a new name but be the same exact Pokemon. I can't do that anymore. There was a patch and I can't do it. So unfortunately, when we Wonder Trade, we won't be able to nickname our Pokemon. Kind of stinks, but we're going to work with it for now on, um, or here on out. We're just going to have to work with it and see what happens. So anyways... And the last episodes, I believe we lost quite a few Pokemon. Uh, let's look at our list of deceased Pokemon really quick. We got Templar, Trouble, Moby, Happy, Ditsy, and Mighty. Those are, I think these three are Pokemon that we lost uh, during the live stream, which is really upsetting. But our new team consists of Gyarados, Trevenant, uh, Urza, Shieldon, and Rattata, which is a Fletch, or sorry, Fletchling, oh my gosh, Farfetch, and we got a Vile Plume. So that's the new team. It's looking pretty good. Um, I definitely don't think that we're going to have too big of problems rocking out with this new team and everything like that, but um, let's see, what town are we in? What town are we in? Where are we? Like, I don't even remember what we did last episode. So we came out of this cave, the Reflection Cave. And we made it to Shalor City, that sounds familiar. Where, did we get a gym badge? Is there a badge to be had in this town? This is how long it's been, guys. Um, that leads to the Elite Four kind of place, I think. And then that's an ocean, so that might be something we have to go check out in a second here. What else do we got going on? Okay, here's a gym. I think this is the gym. Shalor City Pokemon Gym Leader Karina. Did we fight her? We fought her during the uh, live stream, didn't we? And that's how we lost all of our Pokemon. Okay. Let's check if we got her badge or not. Uh, Trudy, let's see. Sorry, guys. I still got all those allergies. We did get Karina's badge right there. So we finished this town off. Uh, unfortunately, losing some Pokemon in the process. And my allergies are... As terrible as always, freaking Georgia, man, and ugh, just allergy season, it's the worst. Uh, so let's see if there's any items around before we actually leave this set, this said town and, and all that nonsense. But uh, if you guys are not people who watch the PGL, because I know a lot of people don't watch that, it's kind of not one of my more viewed things on the channel. Uh, some weeks I'll get like a decent amount of views from it, and then other weeks it's like nobody's really interested kind of thing. So if you guys are at all interested, or at least just want an update without watching, 
Uh, we made it to the championship game. Unfortunately, we lost the championship. But, I mean, we were runner-up, so, you know, that's pretty darn good. Um, the season's going to start back up again in uh, June. I think it's, like, June 10th or something along those lines so i'll be really excited so we'll have we'll have some more videos um pgl videos coming out in the next couple months uh we'll definitely have a draft video before that because the draft is going to be like may 20th i think or something along those lines so we're going to be doing that very soon too um i'm just checking all these buildings so there will be some more pgl stuff if you were a pgl fan fairly soon we've got a lot of teams coming this season i can't talk just yet about who's uh who's coming because it's like anything like anything can happen within the next two months people could leave people could join rejoin things like that some people might be like okay never mind i can't show up but the plan is to have 16 teams 16 coaches uh which is absurd <laughs> it's it's actually just absurd uh that's a lot of coaches and uh it's gonna make for a much stiffer competition for sure uh, we'll have to hopefully we can do as good as we did, but we might not um, Okay So yeah, it's gonna be an exciting season next season of the PGL season four. Can you believe that? It's gonna be four seasons of the PGL. We were in the first we've been in every season funny enough besides there was like a preseason the test if this like the there was a season that was to test to see if the league would work out um that i was not a part of but it was just like a mini season that didn't even get uploaded i don't think uh or something along those lines um i don't know i wasn't part of it but i was in the official season one uh and then i dropped out after season one i stopped and then got reinvited because another team had dropped out and i was like sure i'll take over their team why not because i like i like the pgl i just was like trying to take a break from it for a season and uh, we had done the PDK or whatever, so I was kind of like, oh, I'm so tired of it right now. So we ended up going into Season 2 halfway through, and then Season 3, we came out really strong. So we've been in every season so far, so it's really cool to be a part of a league like that. But anyways, oh, Karina, I mean the Mega Evolution successor is waiting for you at the top of the tower. I feel like we already did this. Did we not do this, guys? Trudy, I think you and Callum are going to complete... Or compete against each other and get really strong. I'm so glad we're traveling together. Okay, so it looks like we have to go up this Mega Evolution Tower with Lucario in the center, who we just lost. Poor Happy. Is this not where we're supposed to go? I guess not. But let's read some books, man. Let's read some books. No? Okay. No books. TV? TV? No? Can't even look at the TV? Okay, man. Cool, man. Somebody just sleeps under Lucario all day. It's like, that's fun. Oh, do we battle people? Only those who have been, uh, been approved may climb the Tower of Mastery. Oh, yeah, you may pass. Okay, thank you, Mr. Karate Macho Man. Randy Savage. Let's go through this door, see where it leads us to. Oh, it's just some people. You got some paint on your shirt, miss. So, do you know the Mega Evolution Guru's real name? It's Gherkin. 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 Sounds like an interesting name. Long, long ago, a trainer came to this land accompanied by Lucario. They found two strange stones. This is said to have led to the world's first mega evolution. Cool rollerblade girl. You shouldn't rollerblade inside, even though I'm doing it too. That looked like an onyx. Did this not look like an onyx for a second? It did to me. I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy. Oh, there's just too many doors. Oh, this episode's going to be called Too Many Doors. It really is. I just, ugh. Too many of them. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yep, okay. They're all saying useless things that I don't care about. Oh, let's see. Um, does it, is it even worth going through this door right now? Is it? This dude looks important. Since you are kind enough to come up here, I want to give you this. It was totally worth it. You gave us a low sweep. I like this dude. I don't think that's a move we're really going to be using too much, but still. I appreciate it, man. I appreciate you. I really do, man. I'm much obliged. So, continuing up the Tower of Mastery. Please tell me that was the last door. We have one more door. <laughs> this would be the Tower of Doors. Something like that. Oh. Oh, this is fancy. Oh, you fancy, huh? You fancy, huh? It's a fancy balcony, man. I would love to live on this, this place right now. Like, I really love this place. 
When I'm here with my Pokemon looking at the wide open sky above, all my worries disappear. And I feel like I can do anything! Alright, Karina. Thanks for coming all the way up here. It was decided that this must be the place where the Mega Ring was handed over. Something about making sure we f we never forget to set our sights as high as the sky. And here it is, your very own Mega Ring. It's in the shape of a bracelet, so wear it easy. So it's easy to wear. I don't know what the heck I was thinking there. Rhymed. That rhymed. Look at that. Oh, truly equipped the Mega Ring. <laughs> On her left wrist. They felt the need to tell us it was her left wrist. Okay. Give your Pokemon the right Mega Stone and try battling with it. Your, me your Pokemon will surely answer the call of the Mega Ring. Too bad all of our Mo Mega Pokemon are dead. Actually, we have Gyarados. Scratch that. Okay. Hmm, Lucario, what's wrong? Groof. Hello? Lucario, are you sure? You want to battle alongside that trainer? That trainer. She doesn't even know our name. Groof. Uh, let me let me see. My phone runged for some reason. Why you do that phone? I don't know what to say. I'm a bit shocked. The traveling trainer seems to have a stronger bond with you than I do. Uh huh. Well, she must be something special. So what do you say, trainer? Will you and Lucario battle against Lucario? Wait, what? A Lucario on Lucario, Lucario on Lucario battle. It will be nothing short of. Okay, you know what? Yes, let's do it. I don't feel like talking anymore because you're saying useless things. So. Oh, she's getting real serious. We just had a gym battle. I don't want to battle you again. Ready, Lucario. This is intense. Let's give it our... Blah, blah, blah. Let's give it all we got. Good job, True. You read that splendidly. You were challenged by successor Karina. Who sends out Lucario. This is way more intense than it should be. Oh, happy. No. Happy. Okay. Uh, let's Mega Evolve, because I'm pretty sure that's what they want us to do here. And, um, we'll go for a uh, fighting move. Power Up Punch? Let's do it. Let's do it. Or maybe I should have went for Swords Dance. I don't know, guys. I don't know. Is this going to be neutral? I'm pretty sure. So, it's not like it really matters. Whatever. It's just Power Up Punch. It's going to be doing, like, no damage, but still. Still, man. Still. Um, there we go. Oh, actually, I did a lot more than I thought. Okay, so fighting doesn't resist fighting. I don't know what I was thinking there for a second. She went for power up punch. How is that even fair, bro? That's not. It's not fair. Well, I'm glad that this power up punch connected because otherwise we'd lose our freaking Lucario we just got. Actually, we're going to re... We have to wonder trade this Lucario away, to be honest, so... Steel. What an explosive battle! I couldn't. T I could tell that both you Meg, uh, that both Mega Lucario. I could tell that both Mega Lucario didn't hold back. Okay, she's talking about hers as well. With strong bonds like that, you shouldn't have any trouble triggering your Pokemon's Mega Evolution. Great. Roof. Uh, Lucario is starting, is staring intently at Trudy. Will you take Lucario? Yes, we will. Your party is full. All right, we're gonna put a P well, Pokemon back in the PC. We'll just put Vileplume because it's the last one. Um, so we'll take Lucario. We'll Wonder Trade Lucario away and see what we get, which should be pretty exciting. Uh, we already had a Lucario, so like honestly, I don't know. So we'll do True Wonder Low, low. True Wonder Low, as usual. There's probably so many Pokemon out there in the world today named True Wonderlo, and everybody's like, what the heck is this? As long as Pokemon and trainers have the kindness to share each other and give each other each other's courage, care for each other, and I don't know what I said the first time. Whatever it was, it was it was not good. <laughs> oh man, oh man, I am so tired. Okay, so let's wonder trade this puppy away. Legitimately it is a puppy, so I feel confident saying let's trade this puppy away. Uh, we're 14 minutes in, that's fine. Let's wonder trade this thing away. Is it right in front of Karina's face? Yeah, you just gave us this uh, this Lucario who wants to travel around the world with us. Let's just trade it away to a random stranger. Sure, why not? Why not? Let's do it. That's so mean. That is the meanest thing like of life. Sorry if you just heard that. Phone slam, man. Okay. Uh, do you want to start a wonder trade? Yes. 
We're going to wonder trade away this Lucario, who is level 32. Okay, we have to take the item away. How do we do that? Give me, give me your item. Give me. Give me. Okay, we have to back out, take the item off, apparently. We can't trade that item. Pokemon? Okay, there we go. Got the item. We're good. Now let's let's trade. Let's trade. We can finally use Mega Evolution though, which is amazing. Super pumped about that. Sorry for all the sniffles, guys. I really am. God, I need to get on like allergy medicine. Uh, level 32. The thing about allergies is like it takes so much out of you. I, like my eyes, they always look bruised. Like they look black all the time. Well, they don't even look black. They look like I wear eyeliner. Like they're like gold. It looks worse on camera than it looks in real life, but um, yeah, we're oh Alphonse. That's a cool name from Mexico. Awesome. Okay, so we're going to trade with Alphonse here in a second. But, yeah, allergies, they just take so much of a toll out of you. If you've never had, like, if you don't have really bad allergies, you have no idea. A worm pull. I think that's dupes. I think we had a worm pull at some point. I'm going to double check the PC. Uh, Alphonse sends us a freaking worm pull, though. Like... I think we had a warm pull though. So I'm gonna re-click Wonder Trade because it should show us our PC while we're in there. And I would like to see while we're in here if we had a warm pull. Oh yeah, right there. That used to be a warm pull, Templar. And plus it's the same species line anyway. So we get the we get the re-wonder trade, which is good. It's good wait, what? Do we have two warrior boxes? Oh, this, this is dead. This is the this is Valhalla. But yeah, we did have a worm pull at some point. So, oh, I don't know why I did that. I don't know why I did that. Let's go ahead re wonder trade away. I feel like all I ever get is worm pulls. It's not like the third or fourth worm pull we've been like wonder traded this series. I mean, I would have to go back and rewatch. But so 32. Remember 32, 32, 32, 32. Let's see what we get. Gender doesn't matter because it's going straight to the PC because we got Vile Plume that we got to take back. Oh boy. Oh boy. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, here we go. We got Crash from somewhere. I missed where it was from. I wasn't paying attention. So we're sending away our Wormpole to Crash. Give us some. Give, give us a Hoopa. We got a Zigzagoon. Pretty sure we have one of those too. Well, this might take us a while, so we'll see. Wonder Trade, let's do this one more time. Give me something that doesn't stink. Give me a Rayquaza. Rayquaza. Uh, let's double check really quick that we don't already have a Zigzagoon. We did have a Zigzagoon. It is in Valhalla. So, time to trade. Uh, my dog is barking. Hopefully you guys can't hear that. Which normally means somebody's at the door, so I might have to check. A Tepic! Yes! 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 I know for a fact we have not had a Tepig, so I will take that. It's one of my favorite starters. Seriously, so cool. It's the cutest. Like, Tepig form is so cute. And then it turns into ugly Emboar, but Emboar's still pretty cool. I just don't like Emboar's fat. You know what I mean? But whatever. We we deal with it. And uh, let's go ahead, uh, bring up that Tepig to level 32 using our Rakandes. Our Rakandes? So let's just do it really quick. This might just be like a super fast part that I skip through or something until we get to level 32 because honestly, who wants to watch this all day? Oh, sh you already have good moves. Yes, I want to give up. Here we go. Evolution time. Oh my gosh. This is so nice. I actually kind of want to use... Um, I kind of want to use Embor or Tepig or whatever, Pig Knight. But uh, our Pokemon are already all partner, so we can't do that just yet. It's good to have a male Pokemon, though, because I think we're running short on males. Pig Knight actually looks kind of cool in Pokemon X. Not going to lie. I like that. He has like kind of a cool pose. I've never seen a Pig Knight in X and Y. Arm Thrust. No, we don't, we don't want to. I didn't mean to click that.
There we go. Okay, everybody, so I've just gone ahead and leveled Pig Knight up to level 32. Um, I'll try to create nicknames for the Pokemon uh, that... Like, I'll try to create nicknames in the sense that I will, like, just come up with, like, fake nicknames that aren't on the Pokemon. The only problem with me doing that is I'm a forgetful per uh, I'm a very forgetful person, so I'll end up forgetting that I nicknamed them a certain thing and just call them whatever it says on the screen. So, whilst, yes, I will probably try to uh, nickname them, I'll probably forget at the same time, so I apologize in advance. We got a nice from Brian. Thanks. Thanks, Brian. Appreciate it, man. Um... Let's let's get out of here. Go get back our vile plume, and um, let's see. And uh, I guess head on to the next town is all we have left to do, really. I'm trying to think if there's anywhere else to go. No, I think we just head on head on out. See what our uh, future holds for us. Let's go down this way, over here. So that pig knight was definitely, or Tepig, was definitely um, a failed uh, breeding Pokemon. Like, it didn't have perfect IVs or something. That person was definitely breeding for IVs because they had uh, all these egg moves that they wanted. Uh, plus, uh, it was the perfect nature. So it was definitely, like, just a, a bred Pokemon that didn't work out the way that they wanted. But it's still amazing. It's Adamant Blaze. It's got Body Slam, Curse, Flame Charge, and Super Power, which is pretty great move set. Uh, before Flame, uh, Flame Charge, it had uh, Heavy Slam. I just got rid of it. I don't know. I didn't really care for having Heavy Slam. So I changed the Flame Charge because eventually it's going to be Flare Blitz and or something like that. Um, yeah, so anyways... That's Pig Knight. I can't wait to use it, but uh, really quickly. Oh, it's no, we have mostly males. I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, we're good. We're good. So, let's. Uh, we don't have too much time left in this episode because of all that craziness. Uh, let's see. Let's go this way. There we go. Trigger an event. It's Callum. Cuckoo Callum. Here, take this. We got Surf. I will take it. If you use HM Surf, you can travel over water. I'll challenge you, <laughs> you to a battle again sometime. That's the best way to get strong, after all. So he doesn't even battle us right now, but he gives us Surf, which I will completely take and put right onto Gyarados right this very second, because... If we can surf for some encounters, I am all for it, man. The more encounters, the better. Get another great Pokemon. So what should we learn surf over? We got Ice Fang, Aqua Tail. Ooh. Oh, we are. We do have a special attack nature, which uh, the only thing is our special attack is so much lower than our physical. It's almost like, why would you get rid of Aqua Tail or Bite? I mean, we could get rid of Dragon Rage. I think we might get rid of Dragon Rage because Ice Fang... Is good coverage. I feel like Dragon Rage. I mean, it only ever does 40 HP, which is kind of getting to the point in the game where that's not even that much anymore, or soon won't be. So let's give up Dragon Rage, learn Surf, and we won't cry about it. We won't. I, I promise you, we will not cry about that one bit. So let's see if we can't get an encounter over here. I don't know if the we have the badge to be able to Surf. Yes, we do. Okay. Yes, we do. So let's see if we can't get ourselves an encounter. Why why can't we go over there? Maybe we can... There we go. Okay, we do get an encounter. Let's see what it is. Not like it matters, because we're going to want to trade it away. It's a tentacle. Okay. Let's do this thing. So I'm actually going to go for a um, Ice Fang, because it's not going to do that much. We are 10 levels over. Okay, there we go. Gonna lay down some toxic spikes, no big deal. That's actually perfectly fine with me. I don't plan on switching out anytime soon. We're gonna go for that quick Pokeball, because I think we can catch this thing in a Pokeball, to be honest. It's a Tentacool. I mean, yes, it's level 25, but it's a Tentacool. It's, it's a Tentacool, so let's see. Oh, for a second I thought it was gonna break out. I don't think we've had a fail capture yet. I could be wrong. But I don't think we have. So, pretty darn cool. I should probably turn off the AXP share. Uh, sure. True. 
wonder lock um that looks good true wonder lock uh we gotta we gotta wonder trade that now did we already fish for an encounter there i almost feel like we did and it's something i'll have to double check in the future it's gonna be one of those things where I kind of forget where we've already gotten encounters, so we'll have to be really careful, but uh, let's continue on, go down this way. I think that's where the E4 is. No, never mind. I'm thinking of the wrong place. Thinking of the wrong place. Okay, so have we ever been on this area before? Route 12. Let's check the map. Mm, how do we get to the map? How do we get to the map? That's not the right button. That is not the right button. Hmm. I don't know how to get to the town map. There it is. Okay, yeah, no, I don't think we've ever been here before. So, we also get a new encounter out here, so we're going to get this encounter. I uh, want to trade both of those away, and that'll probably be the episode. So, I can't wait to see what we're going to get this time around. Okay. Can't wait to see what we'll get. I've got to check that patch of grass, too, for an item. I feel like there's a cheeky item over there. It's a slow poke. Oh, man, I would actually kind of want to have a slow poke. Oh, we already had a slow poke, apparently. Or maybe we caught it and traded it away. That could be a possibility, too. This is level 24. Should be able to live in Ice Fang. Because these things are normally pretty darn fat. I thought that Ice Fang would do a little bit more than that. But I'm just going to go for one more and start throwing Pokeballs. Maybe maybe two more. We'll see. just feel like I might crit. Even if I crit, would he survive? I think he would. I think he would survive if we crit. So I'm going to go for it. Just We'll see. Don't crit, man. He did crit, and he survived, and he's frozen. Awesome. This should be an easy catch. And if he breaks out of this, I will cry many tears. Many, many a tears. So let's go ahead. Pokeball. Don't break out of that. Break all laws of this game. If you break it. Okay, there we go. Okay, so it's time to wonder trade two more Pokemon away. There'll be three Pokemon on the episode. And Gyarados grows level 36 from catching a slow poke. So, pretty cool. Pretty darn cool. Uh, yes. Although, I really don't even have to do this anymore. But I'm still going to do it. Under. Lock. Bum, bum, bum. Okay, so let's trade off those two Pokemon. Actually, nah. nope, no item. Oh, there it is, a honey. Oh, you're so sweet, you called me honey. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, nope. Okay, so from the safety of the no grass patch, we're going to go ahead, trade off those two recent catches. Um... Which are Tentacool and Slowpoke. So let's do it. What? That was weird. That was really weird. Hopefully this time that doesn't happen again. Cubone! Oh my gosh, I will take that. As long as we didn't already have a Cubone, which I don't see why we would. Frost sent over Cubone. Okay. So we got ourselves a Q-Bone Bone Bone. Uh, let's also wonder trade away 
the slow poke. Uh, let's just double check we didn't already have Cubone. I really don't think we did. We didn't, so perfect. And now we trade away this slow poke. Let's see what we get. I was pretty excited about that, uh, that Cubone there. That's fairly decent. Marowak, while it's not the greatest Pokemon in the world, it's still pretty cool. You know, how often do you see a Marowak in a Let's Play? Um, Pokemon's so catchy. We got uh, Adam from France, so let's see what Adam's going to send us. Better be something good, Adam. You're from France. Give me some some French Pokemon. What, what kind of French Pokemon? What do you think of when you get a French Pokemon? Some sort of bird for some reason? Gothita. This is a Pokemon I pretty much completely forgot about. I will take it, though. Gothita. I will take a Gothita all day, every day. These were... <laughs> these water trades actually turned out to be really, really solid. So... I will take it to the bank. Let's go ahead and save our game before anything bad happens. Oh, I forgot. The tentacle is 25. Um, and I'm not sure what the other thing was. That's unfortunate, but uh, I can always look it up later when I go to use them or something. So I just rewatched this episode and see what level they were. It was 25 for the tentacle and 24. I know I just did that wrong. 24 for the slow poke. So. Uh, Wants to trade? No, I'm okay, Adam. Thanks, though. Thanks, thanks, Adam. I will take that Gothita to the bank. Let's see if we can't cut this. No, can't cut this. I guess we'll make our way down the route a little bit. Oh my gosh, a Tauros. I love Tauros. If you guys didn't know, Tauros is one of my favorite Pokemon. Uh... Not because it's really good or anything. It's not bad, but it just looks cool. I really like the design of Tauros. So, Tauros is a beast. And uh, this is where we're going to have to surf. And we get a gift Pokemon here, too, actually. Any items? No? Okay, so I think we get a gift Lapras right here. No? Really? I thought we got a gift Lapras. I, I don't know what I was thinking. Maybe I was wrong. For some reason, I felt like we got a gift Lapras there. What's that? What's that shiny? Shiny, shiny. Give me. All right, let's battle this dude. It's been a, it's been a little bit since we had a good battle, so we'll go ahead, switch up Vile Plume to the front because obviously we're gonna be fighting some water types, so might as well get some XP on on Vile Plume. Hello, pay attention to me. He just swims away like it's no big deal. Ugh. That's so annoying. Just battle me, man. There we go. Finally making some eye contact. Boom, 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 boom. Alessandro. Alessandro. It's such a weird name. Not really. If you're named Alessandro, I'm sorry. I did not mean that. It's just a unique name. And I can't, I can't make fun of it because I have a unique name as well. So, um, let's go for, uh, should we go for the Mega Dream or the Stun Spore or the Sleep Powder? I, I can't decide. Stockpile. Oh, it's defense and special defense raise. So, I may want to, uh, put this thing either to sleep or stun it. Actually, Poison Powder. Let's go for it. He avoided the attack. He goes for revenge, which isn't going to do much because we didn't do much to him. So let's go for that poison powder again. He sets up another stockpile. The poison powder is going to be really clutch here if we can land it. He avoids the freaking poison powder again. Sets up his toxic spice. This is not looking good for us. He avoids three poison powders. Oh, is it because he's... Oh my gosh, I'm so dumb. I'm uh, I'm really really dumb. Well, actually, technically, I think he did avoid it three times, but it doesn't affect him anyways, because it just that time said does not affect instead of does not. I mean, avoid it or whatever. So, feel really dumb, guys. I'm really sorry about that. I derped for a second. I forgot that this thing's half poison. Um, for whatever reason, who knows why? I guess just because I'm a derp. So, Mega Drains all day. 
Even though they're not going to do anything now, because he's at, like, plus three. I may want to even switch out. I just I don't think Fletchling... Fletchling... Did it again. Farfetch will be doing very much. You got a crit. We already lose Vileplume. This is why, like, I need to end the episode when I'm, like, gonna, when I say I need to ep end the episode, when I'm, like, sitting there and I'm, like, oh, I should end the episode, but then I decide to continue it on for some reason. Yeah, no, I should have ended it. <laughs> but there we go. We come out. We get, okay, he's gonna set Toxic Spikes. Two Toxic Spikes, but that's okay, because we're not gonna be switching out now. Fletchling should be able to finish, far-fetched, should be able to finish this thing off. I don't know what my problem is. Rentata. Rentata. Should be able to finish this thing off. Uh, Binacle. She still has another Pokemon. Or he. Oh, this is so rough. Binacle, man. And that, that thing's going to be super effective against me, isn't it? This is part rock. Let's go for the knockoff. I don't know why I went for that, to be honest. I have no clue. Let's go for Aerial Ace. I don't know, guys. I don't know what to do. It's not very effective. I should have went for the slash, but that's never it's not very effective either. So I think Aerial Ace actually is the better play. Please tell me you have no more Pokemon after this. You don't. Okay, good. So one more Aerial Ace. Hopefully it'll take this thing down. Nope, it does not. It goes for the slash. We should be able to take that. And then clamp damage. Oh my gosh, this was a close match. This was really, really close. We're gonna go for that final aerial ace. And goodbye, Binacle. Goodbye, sir. I can't believe you killed a Vile Plume. I was really excited to use that. I'm the worst trainer in the world. Let's learn Curse. Who wants to learn Curse? Forest Curse. What's that do? The user puts a Forest Curse on the target. Affected targets are now Grass type as well. No. It's interesting, though. Keep old moves. Okay. So, Alessandro has ruined our day. I do not appreciate that, Alessandro. Um, we're going to... Can we fly? I don't think we can fly yet. So, I'm going to swim across this river again. Back to that Pokemon Center. Drop off Vile Plume. See if we can't make any switches. And uh, then end off the episode. <laughs> So, let's go do that. Rather unfortunate. It really is. <sighs> let's go. Okay. This is really upsetting. I can't believe we lost a Pokemon this episode. So, Vile Plume. You weren't on the team long, buddy, but you will never be forgotten. Goodbye. So that leaves us with Farfetch without uh, without a partner. Uh, Farfetch is a male, so we can't actually scoop up Pignite, which is really unfortunate, or Cubone. Gothita we can scoop up, though. Um, we do already have a Psychic type, though. Uh, Tubbs, Karina... Uh, Spoink, Solosis, all these psychic types that are girls, they just wouldn't, they wouldn't work well together. Zora is dark. I guess. Hmm. my phone keep doing that stop it phone stop it so i guess we'll take zorua i guess and then you were part who are you partnered with were you partnered with shield on seriously that's so sad i'm so sorry for you <laughs> okay okay well uh guys that's gonna be it uh, for this episode of True's Pokemon X Wonder Wedlock. If you guys did enjoy it, you want the series to continue, please go ahead, shield bash that like button down below. Uh, without your support, this series may die because, like I said, 
Uh, it's completely my fault. I stopped uploading it during the PGL season for numerous reasons, but... Um, so if you guys lost interest in the series, then that's fine. Just let me know and maybe we can start something new. Uh, I wanted to do a co-op with a really good uh, friend of mine on YouTube, so maybe we'll do something like that. I don't know. But uh, yeah, let me guys let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Hope to see you guys all in the next one. Till then, though, stay frosty. Peace out.